would have thought 40 years ago we'd all be sitting here doing Monty Python, eh? Aye, aye, aye. In them days, we was glad to have the price of a cup of tea. A cup of cold tea? Aye. Without milk or sugar. Or tea. In a cracked cup and all. Oh, we never used to have a cup. We used to have to drink out of a rolled-up newspaper. Best we could manage was to suck on a piece of damp cloth. But you know, we were happy in those days, although we were poor. Aye. Because we were poor. Right. Aye. My old dad used to say to me, money doesn't buy you happiness, son. He mm. was right. All right. I was happier in those days and I had nothing. We used to live in this tiny old tumble-down house with great big holes in the roof. You were lucky to have a house. There were 26 of us in one room. No furniture, half the floor were missing. We were all huddled in one corner for fear of falling. You were lucky to have a room. We used to live in corridor. Oh, we used to dream of living in a corridor. <laughs> Would have been a palace to us. We used to live in an old water tank on a rubbish chip. <laughs> Got woke up every morning by a load of rotting fish dumped all over us. House? <laughs> Well, when I say house, it was only a hole in the ground, covered by a sheet of tarpaulin, but it was a house to us. We were evicted from our hole in the ground. <laughs> we had to go and live in the swamp. You were lucky to have a swamp. <laughs> there were 150 of us living in shoebox in Middler Road. Cardboard box? Aye. You were lucky. We lived for three months in a rolled-up newspaper in a septic tank. <laughs> you used to have to get up at six in the morning, clean the newspaper, go to work down the mill 14 hours a day, week in, week out, for sixpence a week. When we got home, our dad would thrash us to sleep with his belt. Luxury. <laughs> we used to get up out of the swamp at three o'clock in the morning, drain the swamp, eat a hard-boiled twig, Worked 19 hours at mill for a shilling a year, and when we got home, our dad would flog us to sleep with a cat of nine tails if we were lucky. <laughs> Paradise. <laughs> we had it tough. We used to have to get up out of shoebox in the middle of the night and lick road clean with our tongues. We had to eat half a handful of freezing cold gravel Worked 24 hours a day at mill for four pence every six years, and when we got home, well, our dad would slice us into it with bread knife. <laughs> right. I had to get up in the morning at 10 o'clock at night, half an hour before I went to bed, <laughs> eat a lump of coal poison, work 29 hours a day down mill, and pay mill owner for permission to come to work, and when we got home, our dad would kill us and dance about in our graves, singing hallelujah. Aye. <laughs> you try and tell the young people of today that, and they won't believe you. Yeah. No. Welcome back to Riddick, ladies and gentlemen. Really great. Now, the next item on the program is... I can't stand a man, really.